My family moved in this area from Michigan back in the mid 80s. And then from there, my dad actually quit his job. He had three kids. And I saw him quit his job and take a risk. I admired my father and he was my role model. I started taking my real estate classes. And from the day I graduated, I started selling real estate and I loved it. When I took over, I said, I want to do it a little differently. At that time, I was also, you know, getting married to my wife, Danielle. And I said, you know, honey, I'm not willing to make the same sacrifices as far as time away from family. So what I started to do was then think about how I'm going to be creating a team. And in 2009 was the start of the team. When a seller hires us and hires me, their intentions are that I will be their agent, not only from the beginning, but all the way through to the end. Because I'd say the number one thing that most clients are looking for, especially in this marketplace and working with a great agent, is communication. And I always have to have an open line of communication with my clients. So by having the team, it's been able to leverage my time to spend more time with my clients. But our primary focus, our primary motivation is to make sure that our clients are taken care of. Nathan is a very extroverted, he's really inspiring and motivating. He comes in every day happy. Nathan is the most honest, humble, caring, giving of information and of himself. So he's the leader. I mean, everybody follows his footsteps. And, and the one thing I, I like about Dart Homes and working in this office is it's always been a family feel. Coming to work here is like, you know, working with your family and it's always been nice. We have a great time and we sell real estate while we're having a good time, so it's always cool. Um, anytime I have a particular question or, you know, issue, I have a whole group of people that I can ask. Everyone's really here to help. That's also another benefit of me having a team, is that it gives me more space, not only to work with my clients, but also to think about how it is I can take this business to the next level. We are always looking at what's new, what can we do next. If one of us has an idea, we'll bring it to the team. So I go to Nathan, I'm like, this is what I want to do. He's like, great, run with it. Once he approves it and says, yeah, this is great, or maybe tweak this, then I'll run with it. I'm replying to emails with a video of me saying, hey, I am a real person. Um, people want to know who they're doing business with and you know who they're in touch with and stuff like that, I think. There's thousands of agents out there, and that kind of helps us to stand apart from the crowd, doing the little things that are different. Every couple months we have different events for our buyers. And we have hay rides, food and beverage, live music. The one thing that will never change in this business or any business is that this is a contact sport. you got to find a way to have a conversation eye to eye, belly to belly with that client. One of my first time home buyers just gave me a hug and it just it just felt great that I was able to help him get into his first home and then to go back over and visit him and see the work that he's done in the house. Just um, really um, awe inspiring to me too, to be able to see people succeed. I feel really good and, and certainly proud of everything that our team has been able to do and how we take care of our clients. and. That means a lot to me. I'm certainly grateful for the people that we have on our team. I do believe that we are a family. We do look out not only for ourselves on the team, but also for all of our clients. So I, if there's anything, I do appreciate what it is that we do as a team, but also for our past clients and how they help us and help our families continue. And uh, so I'm just, I'm, I'm very grateful for everything that we have right now.